Really? I was talking to myself all that time. Okay, let's start over. Hey, this is Renee. Remember I had done some videos about traveling and my wild natural hair? Well, now we're starting a new journey. This one is about me and my, my van, Blueberry. And so our first day out was yesterday and we had someone uh, give us a recommendation as for a place to park because that was a concern. And I was given a nice uh, reference. I talked to the people and they said I could park there anytime. And um, even across the street from where their parking is, there's uh, more parking because there's like an empty house there. Um, it's in the uh, college area of town, so there's, you know, she said people coming and going all the time because the kids, and um, so I came in. The first thing I wanted to do was to make sure I was private, so I'd gotten some craft paper, and um, I started my little project in the back, and oh my gosh, it took like two hours or so for me to get all the windows done. I didn't do the front. I wasn't even really thinking about the front so much because um, my idea was to put up a uh, some type of a curtain. I don't know if you can see the little bungees. But um, so I had bought those before I came. I bought the crab paper and some bungees and a couple of other things. And so I, I finished the back and then I took a break and then I started working on the curtain and I knew it was going to be too thin so I had gotten a, I gotten what is, because it's not set up. I mean literally I'm just sleeping on the seats right now. That's how I was not prepared. So I got this fabric, it's like a quilted fabric. And I had gotten it because I thought it would be thick. I knew it wasn't gonna be big enough for the windows, but I thought I could do something with it. So I decided to sew it in the middle of the sheet to make the middle thick. And then the, it fit perfectly in the middle. Only the ends were a little uh, see-through. Oh, great. To redo that. So anyway, I did my sewing last night when I, I needed to move around um, after doing the paper and stuff. And so I went to this little shop and so far the only all night place is not even near all night. It closes, I think, I think it closes at 10, but it might close at 2 because they, they serve drinks. I'm kind of confused about that. Anyway, so I went there to get something to eat because I hadn't really eaten all day and so I had some pancakes And so when I got back to the car, I wasn't really ready to come back and so I was kind of noticing the downtown and There's like a couple cars here and there. There are a lot of people walking around There's a lot of homeless people down there, but there's also people going between you know eating and bars and stuff and so there were cars parked and so I thought, you know what? It's not the greatest place to park, but there was a light and just enough light for me to thread my needle. And, and there was a guy playing music on the corner. So it was actually pretty cool. <laughs> he played the music and I did my sewing. And I actually could sew another row, I think for sure, to make it stay better. But so I did that kind of quickly just because I wasn't sure, but there was a car already parked in front of me. So um, I think this guy is backing up to do construction here. Anyway, so yeah, this is just kind of an introduction video. I, I need to get to the laundromat before I go to work in a little bit. So I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks.